If you're an agency owner using Play or thinking of getting Play, then you're gonna want to watch this video. We're about to release a new way to generate campaigns within Play for you and your clients. We cleaned up a few recurring headaches. First one being clients who come here and they ask, okay, what do you need from me? Now we created a guided flow so that they know exactly what they should be doing at every step of the way without needing hand holding to do so. Number two is staring at an empty prompt. Now with our fully editable product groups, you get guided through the generation of your campaign so that you do not have need to wonder uh, if you should be putting an offer, describing your whole business or whatever when you're trying to generate a campaign. And number three is reusing prompts. We already had saved prompts, but with our new product groups, you'll be able not only to make it more specific and more catered to the audience that you're trying to get to, but also you will be able to launch your campaigns even faster than with the saved prompts. So yeah, without further ado, let's jump right into it. So for this demo, I'm going to be using this energysage.com site. It's basically a renewable energy solar panel provider. I simply drop their URL in here, tapped on get data from website, and this will grab all their information from their site. Then on step number two, you will be able to customize the instructions, meaning the tone that will be used to reach out to your clients. And now on step number three, you'll find that three products are generated as soon as you scan your website. You can customize them or add images to them to make the launching process even faster. So when adding images, you can scan them from your website. I just selected a few from here, but you can also generate them with ChatGPT, upload them or grab them from your Meta accounts. And with that, we have our first group ready to launch. Now, this is what the launcher looks like once the update goes live. And a really important detail is that if you already have your brand context set up, you do not need to go back, modify it and add the product first. You can just go here and quick launch whatever you want to do and simply tap on save product so as to get that information saved in there and be able to make the most out of the product groups without needing to do any manual setup. But now to the launcher itself. First, you'll find the goal selector. You're probably familiar with this, but it is a bit different now to guide you even better with them. So you can drive leads, you can get website actions, or you can build awareness and engagement. This will be based on the industry that you select for your business. On step number two, you'll find this dropdown where you will be able to select any previously generated product, or as we said, simply start from scratch with a quick launch, add a specific offer you want to do. This will be based on your brand context and industry description, and you can save it to later reuse that product over time and to optimize further on. Otherwise, if you have generated products in the past or you have saved them from here, you will be able to select them from here. They will automatically add the raw assets in here provided to generate your campaign, your prompt and everything so that it's ready to launch. You'll also be able to modify the prompt with the help of the AI with this stars icon where you can actually choose a different marketing angle, add a specific promotion, or even do a specific audience focus. And with this, you'll be able to modify your campaign in just one click. So let's tap on generate now. So after a few seconds, this will generate all of your creatives with videos and images, all of your targeting, your headlines, descriptions, and everything needed for your launch. Okay, so this has finished loading and the AI has generated a whole bunch of creatives for you to test out on your campaign. It has also generated the headlines, descriptions and the targeting for our campaign. And all we would have to do is select our location, check our budget and we'll be ready to launch. Now, we have also added a few small features like this clear all button, which will help you get started from a clean slate and also the toggles to turn on creative audience and copy generation to give you full control of what you want the AI to actually generate and also to save you even more time if you have your own creative team or if you want to use your own creatives. In Finally, remember that at any point your clients will be able to check out this tutorial to learn more about how to prompt and generate their campaigns. 
So that is all for today. Next week, we'll be hosting a live demo on our first ever Play Pulse Live, <laughs> where we want to update you, gather feedback, and answer any questions you might have about this and the coming things in play. Leave a comment on what you would like to see next, and of course, subscribe to keep up with everything that we're working on here at Play.